Alrighty, here I come from the green room of connections for our second attempt at a video blog since the last one sort of didn't turn out. Let us begin with Cami, who is our script supervisor and goddess of all things, who has discovered living peeps on the internet. Oh, my bad. Assistant, <laughs> assistant director and goddess of all things Hi. has discovered living peeps on the internet, and we will be hearing about them on her blog, which I will have to get the link from from her. <laughs> because the living peeps are really frightening, and you really have to see the video. And here we have our director. Hello. <laughs> He's not wanting to make any comments today. He's waving at us. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Someone has a video of the chickens, and yet they've called the video Aroused Turkish Chicks for Sale. Jackman? Yeah. Aroused. Aroused. Oh wow, they're they're aroused. <laughs> oh, that's not just colorful chicks. That's not just colorful chicks. Okay. Oh my god. I've never understood. Okay, maybe this video we won't be linking to. She thought you looked like you, Jack. And here's the rest of our cast. Oh my god, they're horrible ones. The man Wait, don't they have sex though first? And here we have the nifty photo collage in the corridor. Television Art Society. And look at this, babe. How would you like to shoot with that? We've come a long way in this industry. Oh, yes, we have. So we continue down the hall into Studio A, which is where the set for Connections is located. Studio A. This is our lovely, lovely set, the slightly dysfunctional office of Positive Connections. This is my domain, Michelle's Fortress, which needs stuff. I keep forgetting to get stuff for it. Perhaps I shall take suggestions for stuff when I post this. I think she needs cute things, like a kitten calendar and, like, I don't know, little international dolls. No. Michelle needs cute things on her desk because right now it is kind of bare, which is my fault because I have not gotten things for it. Everyone else has cool stuff on their desks. This is Anne's desk. She has the nifty print there and good books. And this is Zane's desk. Me has the sad, sad alarm clock that Mike is demonstrating for us now. And here we have, of course, this is Ellie's desk with Nunzilla. Dun, 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 who will actually walk and, yes, she shoots sparks out of her mouth. And there is the infamous pumpkin spice hand lotion. And the, inf the reason that it is infamous you will see in the first episode here with the cameras upon it and our crew assiduously working with them, we have Jeff's, not Jeff, um, Andy's desk. And he has, for some reason, a vinegar cruet on his desk and some other interesting glassware. And his desk has a book called Women's Ways of Knowing. I wonder if there's something we should know about Andy. He also has this lovely, lovely, very crooked painting behind his desk. This is our break area with the counter and the cabinet. See, it's, it's an office. Our clock does not work. And if we go around the corner, beware the C-clamp. Here's the door into the small office, which is currently not an office as it has a large ladder in it. The nifty painting slash window on Jeff's wall. And that thus endeth our tour.